My sister, she's a very fun girl. She she makes a lot of funny jokes and she she smiles a lot. She laughs a lot, and I think that's that's very nice to have somebody like uh, as a family member who always brings up the the happy mood. Yeah, my brother, he's a very nice person. And he always gives a lot of tips as well for my matches because he has the experience. So yeah, I learn a lot from him. That's uh, really nice. Cardiologist. That's a girl. Need to use more, man. A dream girl. Dream girl. girl. A girl. 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 Okay, okay. Again. <laughs> Again. Okay. Uh, his dream girl. I think it's uh, for sure. She's very sweet, funny. She will be pretty. Uh, she's she's quite tall. Yeah. And probably she will be sporty as well. That's for sure. His dream girl. Uh, she has to have, of course, a kind heart. Um, easy going, like uh, a bit like, uh, and a humble girl as well. So. I think he will go on a blind date because uh, I think he likes surprises. And I would go on a blind date. I've never been to one, but I would go to one. I think could be quite fun and interesting. And uh, sometimes in life you have to be a bit crazy as well. So I would go. Uh, I, I'm not that superstitious. Uh, luckily, I think as well because. It's not always easy to be superstitious, but luckily I'm not. Uh, I'm usually busy with checking my bag if I have everything, if I have my shoes, my records and stuff. Um, for every match, I tie my shoes on the court. That's something I always do. Good question. Um, I think I, I agree with my sister what she says, because we only live once and that's I think, uh, you, of course everybody knows that, but we, you have to really realize that and I, when I'm in the hospital sometimes I see a lot of dramatic things and you really realize that and um, so I would advise just do what you want and, and go for your goals and don't always strive to be better, I think that's a good one, whatever you do. I think my sister would have liked to be a, like a musician as well. She used to play the flute a lot and uh, she could because she had a bit of time struggles but she, she, I think she liked it very much, right? Yeah, that's right. I played it for many years and uh, yeah, it was quite sad when I had to stop but I had to make a choice. Between? Yeah, between the, the flute and badminton and tournaments. So I couldn't go to the lessons anymore. Uh, when he was small, he wanted to be a pilot. He really liked planes. So yeah, that was a very dream. That was his dream. True, actually. Uh, I liked it for a long time. Until I was maybe 12 years old, I wanted to be a pilot. Then from 12 to 15, I realized that pilot is not that easy. So then I thought I want to be a, like a, a plane building engineer, because that was also very fascinating for me. And probably from the age of 15, I considered a, a medical career to, to continue with. I hope to combine badminton as long as I can with my studies. It's, uh, it's always a bit tricky, of course, so I cannot plan really at a long, like I cannot make a 10-year plan. But uh, I will try to continue as I'm doing now and uh, just hope to, to play as good as I can. I also will try to combine my studies uh, with badminton as long as I can. I still have some years to go with my dentistry uh, studies, so we will see what will happen in the future. <laughs>